At Toyota, safety is embedded into everything we do. I often like to tell our engineers that we may not be doctors, nurses, or firefighters, but we have the opportunity to help save lives. People don't tend to think of data and safety together, but ultimately having the right data at the right time can help us determine if a vehicle has been in a collision. And it allows us to help get emergency responders to a customer's vehicle in the most efficient way possible. To achieve this, we pull the data from hundreds of sensors in the vehicle, from millions of vehicles globally on our platform, which equates to petabytes of data. So the challenge was how do we process all of that data in real time when every second counts? We realized, wow, this is a really interesting engineering problem to solve. And one of the things that we love about AWS is there are so many options. It allows us to be so creative. For our cloud migration, we were able to seamlessly transport our data into AWS really easily by just flipping a switch. So the moment that a vehicle is in a collision, there is a trigger event that goes from the communications module up to our AWS cloud. And then somebody from our call center will be talking to your vehicle within three seconds. At the end of the day, it's just super exciting to think about the future for Toyota vehicles. For instance, we are also using newer technologies like generative AI. And with a managed service like Amazon Bedrock, we were able to ingest the owner's manual and develop a generative AI powered assistant. And it's gonna be able to tell you anything about it by using some very simple voice commands to saying, hey Toyota, tell me about this icon. That icon means the traction control system has been enabled due to slippery road conditions. It's almost like saying your car is now going to be the expert on itself. Sometimes when you get involved in the tech, you just get into the weeds of the code and fixing things and you kind of forget the actual impact that you have on the world. There's a lot of pressure, but there's also a lot of pride. Being able to wake up every day and know that that is what I'm gonna be working on.